Hey guys, welcome back and Merry Christmas. This is Philip Sessions from the Healthy Living Sessions podcast. Once again, just wishing you a Merry Christmas. I hope this podcast, uh, you maybe you're listening today here on Christmas or maybe it's just a reminder of Christmas uh, as you're too busy to listen to it on Christmas and I totally understand uh, families in town or maybe you're out of town spending time with family. Maybe you're in a remote location where you don't even get internet, so you can't listen to this podcast right now. But uh, nonetheless, I hope you either have a great Christmas or had a great Christmas. But you know, with all this, there is so much love in the air, guys. So much love in the air during this Christmas time. You know, of course, spending time with families and loved ones. Uh, we see people getting and receiving gifts. And of course, all those proposals. You know, we can't forget about that. This seems like the time of year to propose. This time, or right at New Year's, you know, bring in the New Year's with a new proposal, right? You know, with a new loved one who you want to dedicate your life to. And while all those things are so great and definitely make life worth living. We also have to keep in mind that there are some of those that are less fortunate than us. And not only am I talking about uh, financially or without families, but also those that just aren't able to make it to their families. You know, we always think about our soldiers, our hope we think about our soldiers, being overseas, uh, protecting our country and protecting others. Um, let's just keep that in mind that they also cannot get back to their family or they may not have a family to go back to. So let us just keep those people in mind as we go throughout uh, this Christmas Day. I know maybe that's a little bit of a downer to some of y'all, but I just want you to keep that in perspective that there's somebody out there that's less fortunate than you. And I think it's always a good perspective to have. And to me, that honestly makes you know things so much more better being a family. You know, me being away from my family back in Texas, living here in South Carolina, I've come to really enjoy that family time I and mean, I always enjoyed it but it's so much more special now and I think part of that's just getting older as well but you know I always reflect back on the fact that I used to have it and now I don't and it's so much more precious to me so I just want to say that to, for y'all to keep in mind that this time of year to be able to have that ability to spend that time with family is so important and so amazing so don't ever forget that you have those blessings. And so I just want to keep this short and sweet today. I know y'all have so many things going on. And so just keep in mind that this holiday is all about love, um, about loving your neighbor, loving yourself, loving those around you, and just showing that love. So for those of you that may not have anybody to, to be with, you know, don't be afraid to, to reach out to somebody this time of year with love being in the air, people are so much more susceptible to opening up their door, opening up their hands to helping you out. So just go ahead and reach out, guys. And on the other side, if you do have those blessings, you do have the ability to help somebody out, why don't you go ahead and do that? I know there's families out there, uh, you know, might see it from the Hallmark movies more, but I'm sure there's families out there that actually go and give back to the homeless and stuff like that, you know, passing out shirts, giving out food, stuff like that. And I think that is such a great thing. But just remember, as you're getting ready to go to your family's houses or maybe you're just waking up or whatever, just keep in mind that this is a great time of year and you should really enjoy yourself and have lots of fun. And this is Philip Sessions with the Healthy Living Sessions podcast. I hope you all have a Merry Christmas and a wonderful day.